I have a KRMF 706 EBS 01 KitchenAid refrigerator. 10 days ago I noticed the interior light were not working. Contacted just answer last weekend was told to replace the LED board in the rear of the unit. Ordered board replaced it. Any rear lights still don't work. Wife added to my incomplete analysis that the ice slash water dispenser did not work at her also meat drawer tempo control is not working. Here is what does work, temperature control, Sabbath mode, vacation mode on control panel and light on ice slash water dispenser. Oh yeah, hinges work too. Can you guesstimate how old your KitchenAid is? And just to clarify, what's the exact model? It is a little over two years old. I put the exact model number above, are you a chatbot Pearl? Yes, I'm a bot. I make the process of talking to the appliance expert more efficient and affordable by asking basic questions. Do you plan on doing the work yourself? Yes. Anything else we should know to help you best? Only what I wrote in the original post I have already done that. Hello. My name is I'll be helping you today. The site will give an additional option to speak by phone which you can ignore if you want. I apologize about whatever advice anyone previously gave you because based on your conditions you definitely have a different issue than was expressed. Did you still need help with this issue? I am a different expert so please understand I have no idea why the previous expert gave you the advice they did and if it was incorrect you are able to request a refund for that previous transaction and you can start over with me if you'd like. Let's go. Need to get the fridge fixed. Okay, can you do a quick test for me please? Unplug the refrigerator for 5 minutes or flip the breaker off. Reapply power and do the light then turn on. I believe they might turn on for a few minutes after a power reset, but then go black again. I have some that a few times dot it used to do that and would sometimes show that the doors were open. It would tell me it was going to shut off cooling, but then the lights would just turn off. If I left the door open and pushed the door switch it had no effect on the lights. Did that to all door slash drawer switches. Currently the light just stay dark. Okay perfect. That's exactly what I needed to know. The problem is going to be your left door switch. The switch was failing and thought your door was stuck open which stops the dispenser from working. It's progressed and got worse so it won't even turn the light on now. Just replace the door switch since it can't tell whether the door is opened or closed and you'll be good to go again. Below is a link to the part and it's less than $20. We are on the honor system here. If you need anything else, just let me know. You can continue asking follow-up questions at no additional charge after rating my service if you still need assistance. How does the door switch come out? Put tape around the switch on the refrigerator liner. Then slide a butter knife or putty knife under the bezel around the switch. Push in and twist slash pry. Go from one edge to the next. Work your way around several times and it'll pry out of the refrigerator liner. The tape is there to prevent you scratching the liner. Okay, so I pull the switch and have continuity between pins 1 and 3 door open. Open load door closed position. Pins 1 and 2 show open load door open and continuity door closed position. 
Not sure it is the door switch. Reconnect the wires to the switch after turning power off and see if it works. It may have reset itself with all the prying. If not, then that only leaves your main control board on the back of the unit because it's not reading the door switch properly. Part number for main board. Sure thing. Part number is. Thanks you have been really professional. I do the same for electro hydraulics for my work. I appreciate the help and here comes your 5 star rating. If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.